Hey, what's going on everybody? My name is Jay Cruz and welcome back to another video. In this one, we're gonna check out a special pedal, The Hog by Talon Electric. Let's get it. If you're anything like me, then maybe you haven't heard of this pedal per se. It's a collaboration between the band Bill Murray and Talon Electric Pedals. They decided to work on an overdrive slash distortion pedal that could honestly cover pretty much everything and still somewhat present itself as a uniquely voiced pedal. Now I'm going to be honest with you guys, the aesthetic of the pedal is what truly caught my eye and I reached out to Talon to figure out if we can arrange some sort of deal to, to get this pedal here in the studio. It isn't just the pedal, it's the box. It's even the packaging that the whole thing came in. They invested A to Z on making sure that you knew exactly what you were getting even when you received it in the mail and I absolutely love it. It's rocking a crank knob, an optimized knob, a load knob, and a clarity knob and then it has a beef switch, which obviously insinuates that there would be some bottom end boost, right? You have the foot switch itself and it's top mounted. So without further ado, let's jump right into this thing. I'm gonna be using my Fano SP6 with Mr. Fabulous Mini Humbucker pickups in them. Let's see what it sounds like. <laughs>
I'm going to be honest with you. I did not expect this pedal to be as versatile as it is. The way it's marketed, it comes off as if it's gonna be this heavy metal machine, and then all of a sudden you realize that though it is a heavier gain pedal, it is very beautifully voiced. There's a lot of attention to detail in the tonality of this thing, and it's very, very wide, and you can get a whole lot of different tones if you just pay attention to what you're doing. Now that I got to mess with it a little bit, I do have a little bit of a better understanding of what these knobs do. The crank seems to manipulate the amount of gain or drive, and it's funny, it almost acts as if it's adding a fuzz-esque element to the sound versus adding gain. The Optimize is the knob that I really don't understand very much, but I love it. All the way off kind of gives you this full punch in the face distortion style tone, and then all the way up, turns it into like almost an overdrive. It almost eliminates the fuzz or gain element to it and takes the pedal to its pure sort of starting point, which is the sound that I kind of fell in love with most, be me being a more ambient low gain player. The load knob almost acted like a volume, so and it kind of made sense if you think of what load boxes do with amps, it kind of allows you to have the amp be full max without it necessarily blasting. So I think that's a pretty interesting knob in itself. Of course, raising it can give you a little more gain and a little more clarity. It will push your signal in the way that it should be, especially if it's in front of an amp. The clarity knob did exactly exactly what you expected. It just gave you a little more clarity, a little less clarity. You want your tone a little darker, you can do that. You want your tone a little brighter, that clarity button will get you there. And of course, the beef switch allowed a bottom end boost, and it wasn't over the top either. Very, very usable, very, very musical. All in all, an extremely versatile and musical pedal that I am totally shocked and surprised with. We just went over all of the pros, but are there any cons? Truthfully, I honestly feel like this pedal deserves a lot of praise. I'm not sure if there's very many cons to this thing. Um, you do have to manipulate it quite a bit to find the tones of your preference. And look, at the end of the day, it's being marketed as a more high gain style product. So you have to know that. I think it sounds great on solo tones and thicker tones. I think it'll sound even better with humbuckers, guitars, and so on and so forth. However, I feel like the versatility is absolutely there. So if you're not a super high gain person, but you want a pedal that can get you there if you needed to, this is the guy. That's pretty much it. I want to thank everyone involved with creating this product, both Talon Electric and Bill Murray the band. Technically, they sponsored this video by sending this pedal out for me to check out for free. I'll be sure to link all of their information in the description box below. But while you're down there, please do all the things that help this channel grow. Like this video, subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so. Hit the bell notification icon so you get an alert every single time I upload a video. You can also check out some of the affiliate links that I have in the description box below, as well as donate to the channel directly if you choose to do so. Thanks so much for watching and until next week.